I think I've always just been attracted to beautiful things and um, wanted to capture those things in my painting. My interest in art started when I was really little. Um, I've always loved to draw and paint um, and I wanted to be a fashion designer when I was like 12 and I drew clothes all the time and then um, I just kept uh, coming back to it and it was really natural and easy for me and then when I went to college I majored in art but after I graduated I went into baking just kind of um, by accident it just happened and and then I sort of came back to art when I was in my 30s and kind of this combination of like plants and food and art all came together into one um, and I left baking and I became an artist full time. My relationship with plants is very um, fueling. Um, I just find a lot of like beauty and um, nourishment through taking care of them and having them in my vision and, and environment every day. It's like, it's like having a pet, um, sort of. Uh, just having like a lot of beautiful, living, growing things around you just reminds you that you know we're all living and breathing and requiring attention. Um, and they are a good reminder to slow down and just um, see all of the, the natural beauty that is just right in my surroundings. My process when I'm working on a new piece, I, um, I find my, my botanical muse, my subject. Um, I take reference photos of it. I find um, a good composition that I like to work with and then I'll do a, um, a pencil sketch outline with a light box and then I'll just use that photograph and my sketch and start to add paint in slowly, slowly. And it takes quite a while because I use watercolor and um, it takes a lot of patience. You just need to wait for layers to dry and then add more layers and um, yeah. And with the detail especially, it's just like layering and layering to get those kind of um, vivid colors and depths that you need. What I want to convey with my style is this line between realistic and whimsical. So like, I want it to look like the plant that it is because I really want to honor that plant. But I also want you to be able to tell that like it was hand drawn and has a little bit of my own personality in there as well. Um, I think what keeps me working, I'm just, I mean, I'll definitely have points at which I'm stagnant or something or uninspired. But something always just comes and inspires me again. Um, and painting is just, I don't know, it's sort of a meditation. So it's definitely a flow state and you kind of get addicted to it. And so that's what keeps me coming back to it because it's just this like wonderful state in which you're just totally consumed by the creative act that you're doing. And, um, and it's beautiful. <laughs>